and welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And without doubt a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Fleetwood Town taking on Manchester United. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. An alert piece of defending. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Davy De Gea begins in goal. Christian Eriksen starts alongside Scott McTominay in midfield. And handed a solo roll in attack is Marcus Rashford. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Promising looking attack. Siala Daniel Batty Lane very alert defending to put a stop to the chance Scott McTominay well that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball can he take advantage Rashford! In it goes! But it will not stand offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Scott McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. Crossing opportunity. Fernandes. He's got to score. Oh, my goodness. He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and Sancho wasn't going to miss this one. From that sort of range, he was always going to score. What a well-constructed goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Lane. This is looking threatening. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Jaden Sancho. It's with Martinez. Fernandes. Scott McTominay. And the emphasis is on creativity. It's there for him. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Rashford. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Sancho, now with McTominay. Fernandes, must be, and there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and they just need to keep the concentration. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place, and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And there it is, the half-time... So the ball moving again. United having already made a big first-half statement. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Can they trouble the opposition this time? And options in the centre. So a throw-in here. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Garner.
And making the move to the inside. Spot on with that tackle. Well, there it is. United have had most of the ball. Yes, they've played well when going forward, but it's been their ability to regain the ball which has made them so hard to play against here. And it makes them such a good team. It's been a brilliant performance so far. So a half an hour remaining. And they have possession again. Ericsson. Promising from Ericsson. Sancho. Sancho! And it goes! A three-goal cushion! And you truly sense it's a matter of how many! Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And Sancho made the finish look easy, as he so often does. It's a lovely goal. So the action underway once more. And it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Well, there's a textbook example of how to press the ball. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Ericsson, to be replaced by number 18, Kate Nero. Anthony. This attack looks highly promising. And behind it's gone for a corner. Here's a change for Manchester United. And short it is. Ronaldo. And that's sound goalkeeping. Who can he pick out? Still not clear. Not the best challenge, free kick. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Oh, they have it again. Danny Andrew. Vela. Lane. Very quick thinking there. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? United being afforded too much space. Casemiro. Lane. And that is the end of the game. It goes down as a United triumph. Their fans.